What's up guys and welcome back to a brand new video with your host Ned and Tiles. Joining this video we have two special guests of course our buddy Liam is back in the chat. Welcome back to the stream buddy. How's it going guys? Glad to be here and so excited. And of course we have a brand new person in the channel obviously a fellow Yugi tuber, magic tuber, pretty much collector tuber and of course is Miss Maddie's son. Welcome to the stream. Hi, I'm so excited to be here, first of all. Pretty new to YouTube, so I collect all three of the big TCGs, and I love to talk about them and do openings on my channel. Mostly Pokemon, Yu-Gi-Oh! and Magic, but I'll probably throw a few more things in there coming up. Yep, definitely, guys. If you guys want to check it out, we'll definitely have the link in the description, so definitely check her out. All right, guys, so today is all about the three big three that she mentioned earlier, Magic, Yu-Gi-Oh! and Pokemon. Obviously, we know about them, but can they compete against each other? Now, that is the question in mind that we want to discuss and show to you guys. So, the big three, of course, is Strix Haven from Magic the Gathering. We have Battle Styles from Pokemon, and of course, Ghosts from the past making the return again. Now, of course, this is going to be a close match, but of course, it all depends on how it goes. Now, for those that may not have watched our previous video, the way it works is whoever pulls the best card from that particular pack obviously earns a point. Now, depending on how the price of it, now, if it breaks $1 or close to $1, that's one point. If it breaks $5, then that, of course, is two points. If it breaks $50 or close to $50, then that is three points. And of course, if it breaks 100 or close to 100, that will of course be the four point counter. Now of course we have our counters in the corners here. Place your votes on who you think is going to win. Magic, Yu-Gi-Oh! or Pokemon. Now let's flip over to the main camera and let's start this. Alright guys, here it is. Here is what I have in store. Of course it is Ghosts from the Past. Now let's flip over to Liam Cam. Liam, show your cards. The battle styles. Here we have. 10 packs of battle styles in all their glory ready to pull some punches and then we flip over to the maddie cam and then we have 10 of the strixhaven draft booster packs oh damn this is gonna be epic guys place your votes as we said now how how are we gonna determine who goes first <laughs> uh i th i think just by rule of thumb ladies first I agree. I agree. Ladies first. All right. <laughs> no, not me. <laughs> no, not. <laughs> All right. First pack. All right. Here we go. So campus guy, cram session, Witherly campus, Sweaty. crushing disappointment, beaming defiant, vortex runner, heated debate. In the past, and oh, that one's pretty good. Verdant oh. Mastery. Ooh. Viral. Okay. So. Is that the most viral right there? I think so. Growth Spiral. Is that for which? It's from the Mystical Archives, and it's number sixty-one. Can you explain a little? Um, obviously, for those that may not follow Magic, can you explain the, those two different packs? So this one's from the Mystical Archives. You can tell by the border going around it. These little fancy things. Mm -hmm. Um, and then the rest is just School of Mages. But the Mystical Archives is special to the Strixhaven set. It's kind of like the shiny vault for- the shiny vault for Pokemon. Interesting. Alright, from looking at the price here though, it does break one dollar. About, uh, about a dollar and two cents. So, for that, you get one point. So now- Well played we'll and a good start. Good, definitely good start. All right, now we flip to Liam Cam. The old battle styles. Gotta love it. <laughs> the difficulty. <laughs> <laughs> when the video ends, uh, Maddie will show us how to properly open these Pokemon cards. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I shall do it in the uh, traditional Pokemon style. Water. Mustard. Gold bat. Bruno, Still a Cobra, the Sad Boy, Galarian mm. Mime, Onyx, Spiro, Sizzlepeed, Reverse, Hollow Still a Cobra, and a Drampa. 
I think mm. Grandpa would be the one I would put more money on. I think Maddie's looking at the price for that one. Team, that's coming up as 10 cents. 10 cents. Dang, got, got the zero points. Count. Got the zero points. Mil poids. <laughs> All right, guys. This is, of course, Ghost from the Past. Now, <laughs> I, I, I feel, I'm feeling good, guys. I'm feeling good. Definitely, if you guys are here, press a like. Press a like. All right. Here we go. We have a Dragoontiti Giraffe. We have the Heratic Dragon of Tef Nudit. We have the Time Thief Regulator. The Proton Thrasher and the Meteor Black Comet Dragon. All right. What is the price for this, Liam? That is a points worthy $1.65. That's a point. <laughs> <laughs> All right, now back to Maddie. Okay. So we have the Spiteful Squad, Silver Quill Campus, Owl and Shield Mage, Battle Seer, Beaming Defiance, Vortex Runner, Pigment Storm, Tingle Trap, Spectre of the Fence, Fractal Summoning, Quandrix Cultivator, Wormhole Serpent. Mm -hmm. Augmenter Pugilist mm -hmm. Revitalize in Elemental. I think this one would probably be the best. Alright, in a mystical archive? No, the school of mages. It's a lot of cars in these packs. Yeah, I think there's like four hundred. Alright. Wow. That's a lot. Unfortunately not a point worthy, only forty cents. Oof, that's a Whoa. big hitter. Alright. Now to Liam. Alrighty guys, let's see Urshifu come into this pack. <laughs> I know, right? If you guys recall, when we did the unboxing before for Battle Styles, you pulled the, the the regular art, not the alternative art, for both the the Yushifu, was it Rapid Strike and Single Strike? It was indeed. <laughs> um, no, um, the single pull, uh, the full art, wasn't that the Eternatus V and the What's he called? The Skylar Full Art. Oh wow, yeah. You got the Skylar? <laughs> yeah, oh, yeah, you did. That's so cool. Okay. I'm a bit jealous. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this has been Talos' chase card for a while and then me pulling it is... But it's alright, he got even on me by uh, beating me down with a waifu Yu-Gi-Oh deck that we did a video on uh, a couple weeks back. <laughs> Alright guys, so... Uh, Energy. We have Phoebe. Why is that upside down? Amateur hour for a second. So, Phoebe, Fero, Cornavine. We have Electabuzz. We have a Baltoy. A Gilsgar. Glizgar. <laughs> a Saladit. A Bronzor. Reverse Hollow Maui. And a Bolton. Bolton. I think I'd go for the reverse Holly. I think I'll go for the reverse Holly Maui, to be honest with you. Okay. It is twenty cents. Twenty cents. Ooh, Battle Ooh. Styles have gone down this. Indeed. Liam is still not on the board. Alright. <laughs> Here we go. Ghost from the past, guys. Can we pull another ghost rare? All right, here we go. We have the Sunsea Genius Losi, the Sunvine Gar Gardena, the uh, Larva Var uh, Dragon, the Heratic Seal from the Ashes, and the Heratic Sky Dragon Overlord of Heliopotis. I'm going. I'm going with this card at number four. That's well played, Talos. This this uh, this set certainly paying off. That's a cool two dollars and seven cents. Nice, another point for Yu-Gi-Oh. Uh, off to Maddie's screen. Okay. <laughs> Let's go, Maddie. Pull that seventy-dollar card. <laughs> I would 
freak out because that's my goal card. It's the demonic tutor. Soothsayer. Confront the past. Reduce to memory. Solve the equation. Strict Proctor. Ooh. And Shock. And Silver Quill Canvas. Ooh. That one is a common, so I think it's going to be pretty bad. Oh, okay. The Strict Proctor. 33. Oh, nice. Uh, a nice, cool 95 cents, and that, of course, is close enough for a point. Nice, okay. Let's flip to Liam. Liam, you are down two points. <laughs> <laughs> Aye, well, it's uh, almost like the uh, Pokemon Snap scenario. Wow, that one came out easy. <laughs> Alrighty, my favorite, Psychic. We have a Quarkle. Quarkle. <laughs> Dotler. A cute pig knight. A epically made Zubat that looks like it was knitted. Yes. Classic Cubone. A Trillish. And then we got the Bip Blip Bug. <laughs> and we got the Roly Coley. And then the Reverse Hollow for a Trurby. And a Vervillion. Okay. Which one are you going to pick? Um, I think I'll go for the Vavillion. So uh, number thirteen, non-hollow. That one's coming in at seventeen cents. Ooh, Ooh. battle style's not doing so well. <laughs> That's all good. That's all good. All right, guys. Time. Back to Ghost from the Past. All right, here we go. We have the Time Thief Retrograde. We have the Sun Vine Shrine. The Galaxy Eye Sipent. The Galaxy Eye Sipent Blade Dragon. The Splash Mage. And the. Ooh, of course, I, I know this one's gonna be good. Evenly matched. I know oh. this one. Oh, Dad. What's you guys are. Again? 126, baby. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's a real humble fifteen dollars and twenty three cents. <laughs> two points, two points. <laughs> oh my god! All right, guys, let's go back to the magic side. Okay. The heart of the cards, Maddie. The heart of cards. <laughs> <laughs> Does that count when it's not Indian? No, definitely not. <laughs> <laughs> Big play. Environmental scientist. Golden ratio. Ooh, that's a nice car. Ooh, this is a mythic. Oh, is it? Yes. Nice. Okay. The token. All right. I'm definitely going to go with this one. It's number 277. 277. Oh, the fact that she reacted that way, it, it, I'm, I'm nervous. <laughs> Some of the mythics aren't as good as you think they'd be. <laughs> okay, two. Oh my god. We're talking $7 almost. Uh, so basically, uh, yes, another two points for Maddie. Wow. Dang. Ooh. That's a that, beautiful looking card, too. That, it really is. Uh, can you show it in the camera again? This one? Yeah, that looks. It has the back. Beautiful. Oh. Yeah. I didn't know there's a. Side. I didn't know it was double sided. Yeah. <laughs> uh, some of the <laughs> mythics have two sides. Interesting. Yeah. <laughs> and so you can wow. kind of pick which one you can play. Yeah, that's awesome. But definitely an epic card for sure. All right, let's move on to Liam Cam. Damn. I'm a worried. <laughs> Maybe I'll pull an art, alt art. I know, right? Come on, come on. Yeah, yeah. You know, if this was the Shining Fates and I pulled a VMAX Charizard, it, it would be, yeah, you know. <laughs> Alright, guys. 
So, so again, my favorite, uh, Psychic, got Golbat, Gil Score, Indeedy, Scatterbug, we got a classic Cubone, a Murkrow, the uh, Tapig, got a Homage, ooh, Reverse Hollow Fan of Wayne, and finally, uh, Phalanx Rapid Strike. All right, which one are you gonna choose? Um, uh, reverse hollow of a trainer card. So uh, number one twenty-seven. That <laughs> one is forty cents. Ooh, mm. not quite. If it was like <laughs> it was if it was like eighty cents, then we'll give it to you. But not quite, my friend. Yeah, yeah. It's not not it's not hit that threshold point that makes it that point worthy. But hey, we move on and we stay positive. <laughs> Moving on, guys, to Ghosts from the Past. Can we pull another Ghost Rare card to really clinch the lead here? Because Maddie, of course, has extreme luck right now. I'm nervous. All right, we have we have the Melifos, uh Sil Sil Silverant, Silverant, the Seedless Shadow, the Dragonity Draft, Heretic Dragon of Tef nutted and ooh another good card the red supernova dragon number 45 liam how much is this bad boy Ooh, that's another very very good pull number 45 is a real humble six dollars and 81 cents all right that's two points that's two points all right guys back to magic Let's see if all two back-to-back -back awesome cards. Chris. Uh, Madison's back. I don't know if I'll get that lucky. <laughs> <laughs> Frost trickster. This one's so pretty. <laughs> it's a common, but it's so pretty. Yeah, we, we, we talk about that all the time. Does it, does it, matter, the, the, does it matter the rarity? Ooh, that's nice. Abundant harvest and... Oh, this is a hard choice. Um, Ooh. I think this one's a foil, so I'm gonna go with this one. This one's number 20. 20? Okay. Ooh, 88 cents, so definitely at least one point there. Okay. Nice, nice. That's not too bad. All right, now back to Liam. Ah, right. Let's see if this can happen this time. Let's see if we actually can pull. At least one point would be nice. <laughs> <laughs> Fail packet opening skills, ladies and gentlemen. There's the crack in there, there. And there we go. And I probably just ruined the cards. <laughs> 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 All right. All right, guys. So we got a lightning. We have Heatmore, we have Tower of Darkness, we have a Karina's Focus, we have a Full Art of This already, <laughs> Spoink, we've got Bronzor, a little cute T-Pig, and then we have a... I always have an issue pronouncing this guy, but it's like Parachisu. <laughs> It's, it's mine foo <laughs> and we have a reverse hollow grum pig all right and then to kick things off we have a Ooh. b a tapu coco v nice full art number 50 is one dollar and 43 cents there Yay. it is he, he's on the board one point <laughs> do, 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 do. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. <laughs> it's ghost time, baby. It's ghost time. Now, the one thing I, I will mention real quick while, as I open this is I actually completed my collection of ghosts. Uh, there's two cards that we just pulled recently here that completed my ultra rare collection. Um, I, I'm still, of course, oh. missing. I'm still missing, of course, uh, three more ghosts. 
Uh, it'd be nice if we can get another ghost today to complete my collection. Or close to my collection, but we'll see. Uh, Ojama Country. Uh, Madoche Fresh uh, Sitar. The Mass Change Dose. The Dark Rickium XC Dragon. And the Vampire Viavore. Um, number one. Number one. Okay. Fair play, Talos. You got yourself another point there at $1.42. I'll take it. I'll take it. Back to Magic Side. Let's do this, Maddie. Let's do this. Okay. Spectacle Mage. Hogwarts Act. I don't know. Hunt for Specimens. Star Pupil. Serpentine Curve. First Day of Class. Professor of Zoom and Seek. Mentor's Guidance. Professor of Symbology. Hall of Oracles. Mm -hmm. Dark Ooh. Ritual. Dark Ritual. I'm going to go with Dark Ritual. And that's Dark. number 26 on the Mystic Ar Mystical Archives. Alright, Mystical Arts. Still though, even if it's not foil, it's still a uh, $2.30. So that wow. would that would be another point. If you got the foil, it would have been five dollars almost. <laughs> well played. The price for <laughs> All right, Liam, your turn, buddy. All right, let's see if we can follow that up with another one, eh? Another and banger maybe in a more graceful fashion too. <laughs> yeah. Ah, there we go. Like like, like I said, off like off. That. Actually, that was pretty good. But we'll, we'll still have Maddie teach us how to open cards. <laughs> <laughs> so, Fire Energy for the first time. Crawdunt. Uh, we have a Dual Blade. So, Cactorn. We have a Classic Shoe. The Cacnea. Pawn Snard. We've got a uh, Timber. A Tea Pig. A reverse hollow clay doll and a conqueror. <laughs> so I guess the reverse hollow clay doll, which is number fifty-eight. Okay, so the reverse number hollow clay doll <laughs> is mm -hmm. twenty-five cents. Twenty-five cents. Mm. Dang! All right, all right. <laughs> all right, guys, back to ghosts. I, I, I honestly I lost what the points are, but I believe me and Maddie are tied. I believe. I think you're in that one. Maybe, maybe, but close though. It's still close. All right. Uh, Cosmo Tin Can. We have the Time Thief Hack. The Heretic Sun Dragon Overlord of Heliopotis. The Heretic Seal of Banishment and. The uh, S S Son of Alan uh, Drya Trentia, I think. That's uh, still a very humble $1.28. Another point. All right. Magic side. Ooh, Rise of Exodus. Pop quiz. Ooh, that's nice. Ooh, what is that? So this is for those two-sided cards. You can play both sides if you pull it in your hand. And this oh. Just represent it. Ah, <laughs> that's pretty cool. All right, so which card? Which card are you picking? It is very shiny, though. Yeah. I think I'm gonna go with this one. All right, two seventy-four, one dollar and sixty-seven cents. Another point for Maddie. Ah, well pulled. Well pulled. Back to Liam. Alright guys, well, let's see what Tyranitar has got to bring. <laughs> Aha! See, I've been watching Maddie do the opening, see, so I'm picking up on the techniques as we go. <laughs> <laughs> I see Fire Energy. Next up we have a Bothorant. Really awesome. Next up we have Crowdant. And then we have a Grumpig. And then a Esper, 
<laughs> and then a classic shink. A blip book. And then a pinch smart. <laughs> Making a return visit. And we have a main keep. Ah, reverse hollow. And, and finally. Ah, <laughs> it's hollow still. It's hollow. So I'm seeing that one as 46 cents. The hollow version? Ooh. Uh, 46 cents only. All right. Ooh. All right, guys. That's fair enough. That's fair enough. <laughs> All right, back to here. Uh, just as a caveat, how, how many packs do you guys have left? Three. You have three? What about you, Maddie? I have three. You have three? All right, cool. So we are getting there, guys. We are getting there. All right, ghost from the past now. I need, I need a few lessons of opening packs with Maddie as well. All right. <laughs> uh, Sh Shai Yar Yaru, the rare metal foes, Bish Mudgear, the artifact Dur Durendal, the evil thorn, and the Galaxy Eye Sipen X Dragon number eleven, Liam. That is a very much points worthy two dollars and forty one cents. That's another pointer. <laughs> All right, back to the magic side. Okay. Yeah, that one looks like it opened up really, really difficult. <laughs> that one was rough. <laughs> okay, Needle Thorn Drake, Lorehold Pledge Mage, Square Up, Pilgrim of Ages, Pop Quiz, Sudden Breakthrough, The Crocodile, Promising Dust Mage. Quandrix Apprentice, Ardent Dust Speaker, Symmetry Sage, Double Major, Ooh, that's nice card. Defiant Strike. I think I'm gonna go off Double Major. Oh really? Okay. 179. Interesting why you chose that one over the other. This one's a rare and then the other one's an uncommon. Ah, very nice, very nice. Two dollars and two cents. So another point. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> I wonder what the score is. <laughs> I think I, I want to say I, I, I want to say I'm at least up by one point, but I'm not I, I'm not I'm not, I'm not positive. Obviously, we'll have the score in the bottom, guys. But of course, place your vote still. This, this could still be anybody's game. All right, Liam, your ball game. All right, so we have three packs left, and hopefully. The heart of the car. Uh, wait, no, different, different game. <laughs> Liam opening like a boss now. Shit, back. <laughs> you see, I, I, I've been taking a hey, psychic. Okay, and we have uh, single strikes, scroll of scorn. Ah, we have a cute little bishop. We have a rapid strike energy. I think we have a gold version of that as well. We do. Uh, Cubone, British, a Blitbug, a Roly Coley, a Chimchar, a Scroll of Scorn, and a. Well, I'm in a loose situation right now. <laughs> <laughs> um, <laughs> uh, okay, well, go for the Reverse Hollow uh, scr Scroll of Scorn. You're breaking my heart. It's 32 cents. Oh my god. <laughs> Poor Liam. <laughs> Don't worry guys, uh, even though Liam is not doing so well with the unboxings, we do have an ETB available eventually for a future unboxing, of course. So don't worry guys, Liam will come back eventually. All right, back to ghosts. All right guys. We have the Time Thief Regulator, the Proton Thrasher, the Metal Foes Metrillium, the Metal, Me Metal Foes Combination, and the Sunvine Thrasher. I believe this is good. That is a <clears throat> that is a very, very, very point worthy $2.31. 
Very Keeping nice. Up with the points there, Talos. I know, right? I think I, I, I think I got a point every round. Um, some more than others. I didn't mean to. That's not a javelin. I'm not, it's not a javelin. Don't kill me in the comments, please. <laughs> okay, <laughs> back to magic. All right, transition. <laughs> Okay. Alan Shield Mage. Quandrix Campus. Unwilling Ingredient. Guiding Voice. Waterfall Aerialist. Bayou Rope. Grinning Engus. Silver Quill Apprentice. Ooh, Dean of Radiance. Uh, ooh. Abilities. An Introduction to Annihilation. Alright. I'm gonna go with this one. 158. Wow. Okay. I was not expecting that. Um, $4.87. That's a two pointer right there. That's a two pointer. Wow. Nice. Wow. Okay. Nice. Uh, okay. I, I think we're tied. I think we're tied now. <laughs> oh, shoot. <laughs> All right. Liam. Can Liam score a big one in this next <laughs> 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 you see, I had all these sleeves laid out just in case I was going to do well. I, I still feel like you're in the lead. I don't know. I don't know. One doesn't want to come out as gracefully. <laughs> if in doubt, start from the other end. Bam. <laughs> <laughs> Just rip it apart. Just rip it apart. <laughs> Alright guys, so next attempt is fire. We have crockle. Carkle. Picnic. We have fan of waves, non-reverse hollow. We have a shink. A cacnea. A pinboard. A little timber. Teeple. <laughs> <laughs> Butterfingers, uh, a T pig, a reverse hollow energy recycler, and a slazzle. Slazzles? Hmm. Uh, I guess we'll try slazzles, uh, number 28. That one is 37 cents. <laughs> <laughs> oh. So sad delivering the prices. <laughs> <laughs> it's so good. <laughs> oh, I'm so sorry, Liam. I'm so sorry. Whoa. That's all right. That's all right. <laughs> don't worry, guys. Our next, uh, if you guys are rooting for Pokemon and are like doubting yourself right now, don't worry. We're gonna have another epic competition with some more Shining Faith unboxing. So. That would be pretty cool. So, if you guys want to see, uh, if you have any suggestions of what we should do, like another shiny faith versus shiny faith or anything like that, let us know in the comments down below. All right, let's flip over to the Yu Gi Oh side. <laughs> yeah, you know, I just, I just realized um, this shining fates tins I have. I have two of them, and each of them have uh, five booster packs of them. In oh yeah. Potential, potential for sure. <laughs> All right, we have the Time Thief Startup. We have the Sun Seed Twin, the Son of Alon Bloom, Heretic Seal of Reflection, and the Shooting Star Dragon TGEX. It's like a Pokemon card, Ooh. but Yu-Gi-Oh style. Number forty-four. Uh, very point worthy. One dollar fifty-one cents. Very nice. Another point to the list. All right, I think, uh, guys, we're at the final pack, right? Yeah. We are. All right. What is your final pack there? Uh, from the magic side, Maddie. Maddie's son. Miss Maddie's son, I should say, actually. You can call me Maddie. <laughs> <laughs> Biblio. Polo winner. Make you more. Relic flaw. Professor of Zoom and see. Professor's Warning, Pillar Drop Rescuing, Curate, Dragon's Approach, Expanded Anatomy, Reflective Golem, Test of Talents, Muse, Call This Blood Mage, and Shock. Ooh. 
I'm going to go for the tallest blood page. You know what he looks like? He looks like he looks like uh, Doctor Strange a little bit. He does. Ooh. I can definitely see it. Ooh, okay. Uh, call this Blood Mage. Only yeah. 19 cents. Oof! Ooh. Okay. No points that <laughs> round. Alright. Liam, now, <laughs> your turn. Can you pull up the miraculous comeback with your final pack? Well, we can certainly try and hope that uh, it'll come into fruition. So, uh... Let's, Guys, press uh, a look. Press a look, a look for Liam. Press a look for Liam. <laughs> press that like for a Liam. Look for Liam. <laughs> and for the first time, we have Steel Energy. We have B Sharp. A single strike energy. A camping gear. And we have a Galarian Mr. Mine. Some cute little scatterbug. We've got a Yamper. A Lickitung. Got the beautiful Zubat. And we got a reverse hollow mine shell. Very nice. Very pretty. Very pretty. And the last card, we have a hollow corsola, a colossal. So what is? We did pull something at the end, so... Oh, give me the dollar. <laughs> <laughs> it's 34 cents. <laughs> <laughs> wow. I feel guilty. <laughs> it's not your fault, Miss Maddie. It's not your fault. I feel like it is. The liver or bad <laughs> Alright, guys. Let's finish strong with a ghost rare. How about that? Now, I, I, I'm not sure what the points are, but uh, Maddie says that we, that I might still be ahead, maybe? But I think so. But, I we'll feel like you are. but we'll definitely have the final counter right now. And let's see if we can pull out the final win for Ghost from the Past to show why it's the most epic pack that's came out recently for all three. Uh, Resonator Engine, the Heretic Seal of Convocation. The Madoche Petting Guess uh, Chessora. Uh, something like that. But it's a very adorable though. Cosmojo and. Oh, I know this one's good. The Starry Knight, Starry Dragon, number 27 to finish. Number 27 is a very, very strong $2.84. Very nice. The final point. And I believe. Because the fact that Maddie didn't get a point last round, I believe I I think I won. I think I won, guys. <laughs> <laughs> well played, Tala. Well played. Oh my god. And I, I <laughs> sorry guys, I do feel bad that the fact that <laughs> for battle styles though. Like definitely press uh, press an F in the chat, right? Press an F in the chat right now for for Liam. <laughs> Alright. F the battle. <laughs> yes. He, Right now, even though Liam is laughing, he's actually crying inside right now. Yeah, I, I, I cracked an entire ETB out of that. <laughs> regardless though, regardless though, hopefully you guys still enjoy it nonetheless. And of course, special thank you, of course, to our special guest, Miss Maddison. Now, where can we find you in the socials? Uh, I have YouTube, that's Miss Maddison, and TikTok, that's the same handle. And then on Instagram, at Miss.Maddison. Thank you so much for having me. I had so much fun. Yeah, we had, we had fun as well. And of course, we'll definitely see you around for another round of Versus. It doesn't have to be Magic. It doesn't have to be Yu-Gi-Oh! But of course, it can be anything you guys suggest. Leave it in the comments down below what we should do next for the next Versus round. Now, of course, let's look, look over to the main screen. And let's talk a little bit about the cards we got. All right, guys, that pretty much includes it. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Now, of course, the highlight of, uh, I guess, my packs is uh, just, just a few, really. I, I, I didn't pull any ghosts in this set. Definitely the Starry Knight, Starry Dragon is a good one. And of course, the Evilly Match that we got a while back. I think that's still a um, a $15 card, which is pretty amazing. Uh, what are some highlights from you, Liam? I have a Tapu Koko V. In all the its shiny glory. How about you, Maddie? This one is definitely my highlight. 
Oh yes. I, I, I like the fact that it is like double side like that. that that's actually a very unique play style. Oh yeah. It's so cool. All right, cool beans. The one thing we were thinking about doing potentially is maybe doing it like an epic collector's style uh, match. I guess you can explain it better than I can, Maddie. But like, uh, I guess your set is more for players than more of the meta than actual collectors, right? Oh yeah, the draft boosters are definitely for the players. And then there's the collectors boosters that are more for collectors. Yeah, but you were saying how much how much was it again for the collectors? Thirty dollars a pack where I'm at. They run anywhere from twenty to thirty. Wow, crazy. Yeah, but um, I don't know. Like, it, I guess we could try to do that because it'll be it would be pretty epic if we could do like a shining faith versus the collectors version of the magic, and of course, ghost from the past. So obviously, let us know any suggestion you guys want us to watch in the future. This was very fun. Of course, special thank you again to Miss Madison. Definitely follow her in her channel. Her socials are definitely linked in the description. And of course, we'll definitely see you in the next video. By the way, guys, before we go, definitely don't forget that uh, I guess sporadically around the video, there are codes lingering out for battle styles. So even though it might not be a good collector set, it might be a good player set. So definitely look out for those codes hidden throughout the video. That's all that we got. Until next time, this is Talos, Liam, and Miss Madison signing out. Bye. Peace. Bye.